So Mike the Third sent an email around to uh, all TOEFOP TOEFOP employees. By the way, you've just gone. Oh, I know. It's a shame. I love you. Look like Mister Bad <laughs> this, from Easter. Egg. This new thing that's happening with the podcast. We it's, can it's tell when we record. Why, why we <laughs> can't record in midday yeah. during winter at your house. Uh, yeah, it's, and it's always just, just this period of time where the sun comes in the window up there, just like and uh, I've like now got a ring light. People can see the reflection. There's like the other lights in the house. Right, I'm trying to do everything I can to <laughs> mitigate against it, but there's nothing I can do. Total eclipse of the will <laughs> is what is happening right now. Um, okay, so Mike um, sent around a very detailed email to say, look, so what we're trying to do is we've been consolidating TOEFOP into one feed, which is already okay. paying off really well. You know, people who wouldn't ordinarily listen to, you know, what two guys, one earn are finding it. FOFOP is getting more listens. Like it's all coming up TOEFOP and, and this is great, but We'd sort of boxed ourselves into a corner because we had been numbering both TOEFOP and mm. FOFOP differently. Mm. And there was a very interesting – Mike had done a lot of research on this, and this is interesting because – It's always been a, it's so interesting to get someone else's outside perspective <laughs> on what you've been doing because there was a period of time where I think we went out of our way. Certainly I did, I think. For things, yeah, our little niche was that no one really understood it apart from the people who understood it. And, but I, when you go back and it's like when like a new electrician comes to your house and it's like, <laughs> who did this wiring? <laughs> why, yeah. like, why is your whole house is held together with bubble gum? Yeah. You your aware? fridge is connected to your bath. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> so, it's not just our fault because no, when we started, and not just well, part of it is our fault because oh, yes. we've been around for Absolutely so long. Absolutely, it is part like, of our fault. Like, like trends have changed mm. and um, protocols have changed and methods yeah. of doing things have changed, and we've just been this old dinosaur lumbering along. And sometimes they've changed and changed back. To be fair, one hundred percent. That's what I was just going to say. <laughs> yeah. So when we started podcasting, it was just everyone numbered their podcasts. Yeah. This is episode one, episode two, episode three. So we started doing that, and then when we started spinning off other podcasts, we started numbering them as well. Then in like 2016 or so, or, or a few years ago at least, Apple were like, hey, stop numbering your podcast because it's going to be numbered automatically once you sort of upload it to Apple. And so people started stopping, uh, started, start, stopped numbering their podcast, but then something else happened where they needed to be numbered. And it's very complicated because we have a server that we upload to and that also automatically, you know, there's a bunch of numbers out there which just don't fucking correspond. And no one and cares very, about really. And no one really cares about. And it's super confusing and... So my brother Mike's, asked me the other day, he was like, how many podcasts do you think you've done with like you know, all the ones you've done in here plus like the ones you've been a guest on? And I said to him, I would have no idea because there's no way to go and look at our feed and even understand <laughs> like uh, best of episodes or like compilations yeah. or what. Like it's, it's in excess of a yeah. thousand easily. Oh, yeah. I would say it's like probably – in excess of 1500 but like there's no clear way for us to be able to just work that out well apparently there is and we're going to try to do that so it's it's ter serving two functions one it's just a kind of um we're going to sunset faux fop yes. not as a show but no. as a brand um, yeah so that, well. so the old shows still are going to be in the old feed where they are now yep. but all the new shows are in the tofop feed and they're going to be in the tofop and feed. there are like i mean not only is fofop still going to exist but in a way we're ex we're expanding tofop and fofop into you know a whole bunch of different areas really yeah but we're not going to be calling it fofop no, anymore because right. it's too confusing for everyone <laughs> <laughs> When you have a sales team that are trying to sell your show and they're yeah. like, what the fuck are we selling? Why are there two shows when it's essentially the same show yeah. just with one of the guys not there? And they've changed <laughs> one of the letters and it was already hard to understand what the name of the show was. Why are you making it more confusing? So it's going to be basically yeah. what you'll be getting in the Tofop feed is Tofop Original, which is this, mm -hmm. Tofop with Friends, which is, you know, what uh, Fofop. me, Fofop. And then TOEFOP limited edition series, like Two Guys, One Earn, and other things that we're planning, where we'll just we'll, we'll focus on this particular subject or a particular guest for a, a certain run. So that was, think about it like we're TOEFOP Plus. That is what exists now. I, I actually said that as a joke, but I'm like, that's kind of really what it is. It's, it's TOEFOP and everything expanded from TOEFOP. Um, so we have to – I've actually written it down because I'm going to be recording – what were FOFOPs, TOEFOPs with friends. And it's like, well, I have to think of a way to like an, introduce the show now. Do I just say, everyone relax, this is TOEFOP 
with friends Ooh, and then, you know, roll into introducing the guests. I don't know. You don't know about I that? I don't know about that. I mean, I don't mind everyone relax. Um, I mean, we have to introduce the show, right? Do we though? I don't know. Do, I, again, I mean, is it maybe changed. maybe it's just everyone relax? Everyone relax. I'm Charlie Clawson, yeah. and uh, my guest this so week that, yeah. is okay. I mean, yeah, I'm not. I don't, I don't. I don't love that. To be I honest, I don't love that either. No. So maybe we keep everyone relaxed to Top Up Original Original Flavor. Everyone relaxes to Top Up. Like, what do we? What do we normally say on Top Up? Because then I guess I'll be explaining what the fucking meaning means to a guest. And hello and welcome the, to Top Up. Up. I'm Will Anderson. I just say hello and welcome to Top Up. Yeah. Okay. Hello and welcome. What about hello and welcome to the show? Hello, maybe- <laughs> welcome to the show. Yeah. <laughs> welcome, welcome to it. Yeah. Like, you know, just start. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, like I'm Charlie Clawson. I'm here with Cam. How Knight. do you start? Do you start? To Mine start used to talking? be hello and welcome to Fofop. I'm Will Anderson, and joining me is guest Charlie, Dave mm-hmm. Anthony, or Gareth Reynolds, or Matt Kirshen, or Jen Kirkman, so what are you or say now? Daniel Sloss, or whoever it is. Well, at the moment, I'm doing so my little side project that people uh, is like two guys one urn. Uh, mm-hmm. So it will still be going. Well, well, people hear this. We're recording what, a week or two in advance, but. Um, uh, it, it's happening over the summer of cricket that is happening in the UK. And uh, so every week I have a different guest host to talk about cricket in the style that Charlie and I talk about football on our other podcast, Two Guys, One Cup. And um, uh, what was the fuck? Oh, so I just say, welcome to Two Guys, One Earn. You know, I'm I'm Will Anderson and joining me is, you know, yeah. whoever is joining me. So like... Well, that's the confusion yeah. is we're welcoming... It's, it's, it's everything after... The show name is fine. Yeah. <laughs> it's just, what are we calling it? It's a good point, actually. You're right. It does feel like it needs like some sort of name. Yeah. Welcome to Topop. Um, welcome to Topop with friends. Welcome to I Topop mean, can it friends. still be? Like, it, it, it's only about the labeling it, right? Because once you're yep. in it, like, like, you know what I mean? Like, can it still be Fofop internally or is that still confusing? Is I that- think it's too confusing. I think we're just we're we're just okay. let's make let's uh. pretend it never happened. It's kind of like the WWE never referred to the history. What are, what of if WWF. we call it no fop and <laughs> make it even more confusing because <laughs> there's not one of us in the room. Um, welcome uh, to um, yeah, you, you're right. It does it still feels like it needs a name of some kind though, doesn't it? Mm. <sighs> all right. I mean, is top or 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 is that top fop now? Like top fop is. Like more than just you and I, Tofop is. Oh, right. Yeah. The show. A good, and it's a good point. Like people can understand that, right? Yeah. Like, yeah. Hello and welcome to Tofop. To I'm, I'm Charlie, Charlie Clawson Mike. and joining me today yes. is like, yeah. 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 That seems the easiest one, right? Yeah. That's, yeah, I think that's right. Yeah. They're both Tofop now. Yeah. That's okay. So the other thing is that um, we're going to renumber. So this is actually episode 451. Um, which we felt was a good point as any to kick off. Like I was going to call it the great reset. And then I had like vague, is that like, isn't that like a white nationalist term or is like the conspiracy that we're all getting replaced? Oh, that's the great replacement, right? So uh, I, I'm just going to, I say, mean, I do believe, I'm I think just, the great reset has more to do with like the new world order or something like that. Um, look, the world economic forum, the great reset, uh, the great yeah, C- conspiracy. The right? Great Reset is an initiative, is an economic recovery plan drawn up by the World Economic Forum in response to the COVID nineteen pandemic. Okay, yeah, but conspiracy nuts have taken that to be like, oh, it's more than just yeah. you know restarting the economy. This is like, the actually Great Reset. There's no reset really. We're just trying to get the numbers right. We are resetting the numbers though. So because yeah. there's there's four hundred and thirty odd tofops and four hundred and thirty or forty odd fofops. So what we're saying though is no. <laughs> those 400 and whatever odd fofops exist in an archive now mm. and from now this is this is tofop 451 and then everything that goes in this feed after that will follow sequentially oh okay yeah right okay so we're just essentially saying those 400 and whatever episodes just don't exist in the timeline anymore but fofop well is they now do here. but they're just they, in they their do. own spot it, in an archive, yeah, somewhere. but not in the timeline is what I'm saying. I'm not saying <laughs> they don't. Right. I'm not saying they don't exist at all. They are yeah. absolutely accessible. But in terms of numbering, yeah, okay. Now I should bring up actually. I mean, yeah. Mike, I know I know you're cutting this episode, and I hope I'm going to use your words exactly because okay. it, it did make me laugh. Um, I because 
the only, the only complication amongst all of this is that there are like part of the numbering issue was every time we did like a best of or a bonus or whatever, we never numbered them. Yeah. So there's 13 like Easter egg episodes that, well, what does Mike say? So he goes, um, what about the 13 lost episodes? They're hidden in the feed somewhere. Forget about them. <laughs> <laughs> Like, I like I totally I love it because like this is what you and I need. We need someone who's willing to make the fucking. We don't want to forget like, about hardcore. anything. We want to be like <laughs> as complicated as it possibly can be. And he's we just like, need, they're like, dumb. Michael Third to I've come cut in. them. They're out it's of just, here. <laughs> yeah, just bring in a scalpel. No one whatever cares. Whatever fucking skin we tags. We need to get rid of these, or you're going to die of. They're gone. Forget yeah, them. They don't gone. exist. But I like it because yeah. I think that, like, for the for the you know for the tape heads out there, for yeah. the real fucking you know people love the deep cuts. Well, yeah, they'll become the unicorn episode. Right. It's like, oh, like you know that best of fucking two thousand thirteen. Like, if you're a completionist, yeah. I think it just gives people something to strive for and and bootleg and all that kind of shit. So I'm I'm are you are you okay with thirteen episodes like? disappearing i mean i don't like i mean clearly from the fact that i have not read this email while everybody else involved in our business chipped in on it you can tell my lack of care on this <laughs> like is i don't care i like i whatever 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 we want to do i've got i don't care as long as people right. can still find all the episodes like i other than that like what they're numbered that's just not you know we talk about this a little on our um football podcast two guys one cup available for exclusive on the listener app um about the idea that like with football players even my favorite football players i can never remember what their numbers are you know it's one of those things that some people are like this person wore this number and this person wore this number i could watch someone play for 300 games and struggle to know what number they wear on their back and it's a bit the same with this i don't really care like you know like Um, the numbering system like i'm i'm happy for it to be whatever it is. It's a it's a little more complicated for me because I'm mm. the one who maintains the website, like yeah. updates and stuff. So I've got to work out what the fuck I'm going to do there. And Foz is the other person because Foz bakes the number of the episode into the episode. Mm. So, I mean, if you're talking collectibles, there's going to be some fucking artwork out there. Oh, yeah, some good like Michael Jordan's been misspelt sort of posters <laughs> yeah, <that's> or right. <laughs> whatever. <laughs> yeah, or his 43 yeah. Wizards jersey or, or something like that. <laughs> Um, so yeah, there's lots of, there's lots of little, um, uh, collectibles and quirks and stuff like that, but that's, that, that's kind of what you can expect from TOEFOP going forward is it feels like we have three streams, which is two guys, one cup, philosophy and TOEFOP, but TOEFOP is the, is going to be one that's pumping over the special episodes and all that kind of stuff, which I think, thank God it's taken us only 13 years to get to this point. Okay. So this is 451 then, is it? Yeah. And so now we count TOEFOP with friends which we're just going to say is like TOEFOP and just like introduce someone else who isn't us, right? Yeah. Um, so TOEFOP with friends um, is now in this numbering system and mm. two guys, one urn, for example, would also be in this numbering system. So if in Correct. a week we like we could have this episode, we could have like, like sometimes it'll be one or the other, right? Like it'll be mm-hmm. a TOEFOP with friends or it'll be like a two guys, one urn. But like there might be a week where – there is both, right? I think next week will be one of those. Okay, yeah. so that means that if we're at 450 now, how quickly do we get to 500? Pretty quick. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty quick. Right. Pretty quick, yeah. which does tie into another bit of news that we might as well yeah, announce now sure. because I think it's going to come out around about the mm-hmm. same time that there uh, is a chance that episode 500 will be a live episode uh yes will and i are making plans to get back on stage we have booked some dates um which we'll be announcing soon yeah. but uh melbourne and sydney only just dipping stage. our toe back in the water to see what the interest levels are yeah <laughs> we, we we had options of big rooms or small yeah, rooms and we chose, we chose like small, small. niche boutique <laughs> niche but also partly because what we wanted that. to do was I think like we've done those fun big shows, Opera House and, you know, the comedy festival, huge room sort of versions of this show before. But we were a little bit more interested in making it a bit more in the spirit of the show, you know, not having to make it this big show and kind of like make it more about, you know, the two of us 
you know, talking on stage, whether there'll be guests and other things, there probably will be, but like with a much more focus around what you normally hear from the podcast. And yeah. Um, so yeah, we're going to dip our toe back in and see if there's any interest in you, um, us doing some live shows. Yeah, so that should probably coincide around the 500 episode. So that'll be a nice little coincidence. Yeah. I mean, I, I don't necessarily think we're going to like, you know, turn it into like a giant celebration around the 500, but I just think it's a, it's, it's cool timing that we will get back onto the stage uh, as we cross 500. Yeah, I think we I should mean, refer to each of those shows as our live 500th. Do you know what I mean? Oh, like, just, just, just these things. Yeah, like, now now that the numbering makes sense, gap. like, I'm just going to, like, fuck with it from inside the program. <laughs> Mike the Thirst just is fucking Play mind scary. games. <laughs> what the fuck are they saying they're going to so do? So we do six shows and we call them all the 500 numbers. <laughs> <laughs> to see the full video, join our Patreon. Patreon.com slash TOEFOP.